Hi, this is Mike Callahan, Dr. FileFinder, and welcome to your Buttersketch.com tutorial on how to backup files in Windows 7 using the built-in Backup and Restore. So here in Windows 7, we'll click Start, Control Panel. When Control Panel comes up, click on System and Security. Now you can go about it a couple different ways. I like to click on Action Center. You can also click on Backup and Restore. I click on Action Center because I can see Recovery, I can see other options here, and here's Backup and Restore. You can see there's a backup that's been done. You can click here to turn on a schedule. So we'll click that. So it does it every day at 11 p.m. You can change the settings. So it starts up Windows Backup. Now Windows Backup has come up and it's asking us where we want to save our backup. I'm going to pick our backup drive. You can also save to a DVD external hard drives select where you want to st store your backup and then click next now you can let Windows choose what files it backs up or you can choose for the purpose of this tutorial just gonna click a few little things you can see here if you want you can include a system image of drive C the system image includes everything so now it's giving us a review of what we're going to back up click here and we'll save our settings and exit mm -hmm. and if you want you can click back up now and back up you see here it shows you how much space is available on the drive where you're backing up to when the next backup is scheduled when the last backup occurred the contents schedule so you get a complete overview of your backup and should you need to restore you would restore from here so this is backing up files in Windows 7 with the built-in backup and restore, and that's all there is to it. Hey, this is Doc. If you're looking for a cheap and easy way to put your own content on the web, go get domain names from Hover.com. Just visit Hover.com slash Butterscotch, and you'll get 10% off and support shows like these. Thanks.